1967. Seven years after Nigeria gains its independence from Britain, the young nation finds itself in a state of crisis. Well, I was actually a schoolgirl when the war was fought. I was in secondary school, but I remember it quite clearly. Um, there had been the pogrom in the north. But there were, war, there, were, there were works produced out of that war, out of the spirit of war, and writers themselves were engaged in the information services. Those who were Biafrans during the war wrote from the perspective of uh, the Biafrans. Those who were on the Nigerian side wrote uh, from the perspective of uh, the Nigerian you know, side. But then there was uh, Wallace Shaw and Kosa who wrote The Man Died. Fiction writers um, like to say that they are liars who tell the truth. And I think that's true. So that we might move things around, we might invent certain things, but there's a fundamental truth that we're telling. Being Nigerian American, you see a lot of things, a lot of those things that are Nigerian from a distance and from an outsider perspective, insider, outsider. And as we were doing this, a fighter jet arrived at furious speed and they will typically fly pretty low. And so the very earth would vibrate, will shake from the, the you know, will tremble as it were. Lion-hearted cedar forest honors for our thunder. Even if you are far away, we invoke you. 